Good dinner, baby. Christopher. Let's get married. Whoa! <laughs> Where'd this come from? I don't know. It's gonna be two years we're engaged. Let's just go down to City Hall. City Hall? What are we, shvugs? You said you wanted a big wedding anyway. Oh, I don't care about that shit. I just want you. It'll be cheaper anywhere. We could buy a house. Plus, a wife can't testify against her husband. You can't have a club, stay out all night getting high when you have a kid. What if we didn't have kids? Fuck that. What's the point of being married? I mean, what if we can't? If I can't, would you still love me? Of course I'd still love you. Why? There's something you should know. A long time ago, years ago, I had a medical procedure. It was before we met. My uterus got pierced. Both of them? There's only one. That's ovaries. So what does that mean? You can't get pregnant? My doctor said it might be hard. A friend of mine gave me the name of a specialist in Manhattan. You knew you were damaged goods and you never fucking told me? How could you call me that? Jesus fucking Christ, how could you lie to me like that? I tried to tell you once. I wanted to. I was afraid that you wouldn't propose. You don't get it, Adriana. I don't have a son. The Moltisanti name ends. That's it. We could have died. Yeah, that's great. Some kid with chinky eyes called Moltisanti. He get his ass kicked every day. You said you'd still love me. That doesn't mean I'll fucking marry you. She's a great girl, Christopher. You don't want to lose this one. She's right. You could have more kids than the Kennedys. If you're married to some twat, what good is it? You gotta have balance in a relationship. I know all that, but what if the kid thing never happens? Come on, medicine today, technology. You want my advice? And this is nothing about aid or anybody else. Stay single as long as you can. Oh, come on, what are you saying? Oh, no offense, but ask me, marriage and I think don't jive. Everybody we know is married. Not everybody. You love her, right? Yeah, you know. Then do the right thing. When the shoe was on the other foot, your uh, spleen, she stood by you, right? And what, are you gonna end up like my Uncle Junior? Or worse, like Paulie? Exactly. <laughs> All right, thanks. You gotta go think about it. All right. 